and the end of part one, three, two, one, action. A long time ago, a poor boy lived with his mother in Agraba, a small town in the Ara Arabian desert. His name was Alad. One day, his mother called. Aladdin, Aladdin, there's a man at the door. What? I will get it, I will get it. Jafar, your uncle. Aladdin didn't recognize the man, but he was friendly and kind, so he will come to him. Come here. Go for please. Listen to me, son. You are poor, and I will help you. At the beginning, Aladdin was confused, but then he remembered his dream. How? Just follow me. Aladdin, Aladdin, where are you going? Don't worry, Mom, I will be right back. God bless you, son. Aladdin and the uncle walked for a while and finally got to a cave. Aladdin was excited. He jumped in the cave and started looking for a lamp. But then he got tired and cold. It's very cold and dark in here. I can't find the lamp. Jafar waited for Aladdin. He called him over and over again, but in vain, Jafar got angry and left. You are a stupid young man! Stay there forever! Mm. Aladdin didn't know what to do. He felt scared and helpless. He tried to climb up when he noticed something shiny in the wall of the cave. Here's the lamp! The lamp was old and dirty. Aladdin ripped the lamp and suddenly a genie came out. Oh my god! Thank you, Aladdin. I was in the lab for 2,000 years. Now I'm outside. Tell me what you want and it will be. Aladdin was surprised. He remembered the dream. He had the other day that someday things are going to change. He will be rich, live in a palace, and never have any prob any problems at all. I wish I were a prince. Okay. I wish I had a palace. All right. I wish I could marry Princess Jasmine. No problem. Whoosh. Hello, Lily. You're a prince. Yes, Jasmine. Will you marry me? Huh? Aladdin's wishes became true. Things changed at, as he dreamed. Uh, we have Aladdin and Jasmine. Uh, we have made you have a happy life. Uh, we have been many children. <laughs> and they lived happily ever after. No, 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 just wait and see. One day, Princess Jasmine heard Jafar in the street. I give a new lamp for old lamps. I give a new lamp for old lamps. She called him and gave him the lamp. Okay. Take this old lamp and give me a new one, please. Okay. Yes. When she exchanged the lamp, her pretty dress turned, turned and dirty, and the palace became an old small house. Oh my, oh my, what happened? Aladdin came home. He was shook. He's not my uncle. He's a bad man. He took the lamp because there is a genie in the lamp. Oh my God. The genie gave us the bells. I have only you. Mm. Okay, let's go and get our lamp. Aladdin and Jasmine went to Jeffrey's house. The lamp was on the table and he was drinking tea. Oof, oof, oof. What a beautiful night. Oh, 
help us so we can help you. Okay. Of course, your highness. Jasmine put something in his teeth and soon Jafar fell asleep. Jasmine, don't touch the lamp again. Okay. Now, where is my grandchildren? Seven. Yes, Your Highness. Can you read? As you wish, Your Highness. Oh, so cute. Like daddy, not mommy. Yeah. My name is Sahar and I'm a storyteller. My name is Dana and I'm a teacher. My name is Katrina and I am my mother. My name is Zulina and I am the servant. My name is Tulina and I am the genie. My name is Zakia and I am Jaff. My name is Zita and I am Jasmine. My name is Monica and I am Aled. Aladdin and Jasmine by Dandelion. Okay, but next time to kill. You Aladdin. I was in the lamp for ever after. No, no, no. Just wait and see. 